I will be running through a demo today of all scripts in Relay Health. And as you can see, now we're going to log into Relay Health as the patient. And um, this, will sh this will sort of show how to initialize messaging from the patient to the provider um, initially by logging into Relay Health. Uh, so we'll go to the message center. And then if you look down at the bottom left hand side, you'll see this narrative message your provider. Let's go ahead and click that. <clears throat> and it gives us the option of selecting the provider and also the patient. So we have the correct one in context. We'll go ahead and enter a title or a reason for the message. And then just sort of a, a small uh, brief explanation of, uh, of what will be in the uh, to the content of the message. And you know, we can, this just for example, we'll just say something like, you know, I finished my medicine, uh, is there anything else I should do? And we'll go ahead and click next. And we'll click send. And uh, a few things are going to happen in the back end. Essentially, what's going on is um, a message is sent out from Really Health to all scripts um, via HL7 message. And uh, right now, that's going on, that's currently processing, um, should happen fairly quickly. So now that uh, all the messages have been sent in the back end via HL7, I'm going to go ahead and log in as the provider. And what I'm going to do is uh, we can see that it's created a task in this provider's task list. Um, and there's a few ways to, to open up the, uh, the message via the task menu. So we can try to open it up here. Um, and the other option is to actually go into the chart. Um, so we're going to go ahead and click on the chart, bring up the patient in question, the uh, cardiology test patient. Um, and you'll see that if we go down to the, um, the unassigned section, it says really health message and here, this is the message we had entered. Hello, Dr. Bond. I finished all of my medication. Is there anything else I should do? So now the provider is going to reply to the patient by opening up Really Health via this Really Health button. And this is all done um, by a single click. Uh, and this is uh, there's also um, some communication going on right now between all scripts and Really Health and just sort of there's a, there's a token process and verification. So we can see that now this patient is brought up in question. Um, this is the message that was sent out and we're gonna to click on reply to patient. And this gives us the option to now reply to um, the uh, patient's question. Okay, we'll say there's nothing else we need to do. We'll send this off to the patient. And actually what we'll see um, is another message uh, or the, the message that we've sent to the patient show up in all scripts. Um, so we'll go ahead and log out of Relay Health. And we'll head back to the EHR. I'm going to go ahead and refresh this list since we're already in the EHR. Open this back up and you can see that it archives the uh, correspondence between the patient and the provider. And you'll see the first message and the second message. Now we'll go ahead and click on the Really Health button to initiate a message from the provider to the patient. And to create a new message, we'll click on New here. And come up with the title of uh, Checkup.
From here, we'll just ask the patient, um, you know, has cardiology test uh, finished all of the medication? And we'll go ahead and send that to the patient, return to the patient's chart. We'll actually, uh, we'll actually be able to see this message in all scripts. So that as we, before, as we'd seen the, uh, the correspondence archive, we'll also see that in this instance as well. Um, so since we're already logged into all scripts, we'll just go ahead and hit the ref refresh button, and you'll see here that uh, there's a new message. This is really health message, and it will be the message that we had sent to the uh, patient. I'll be going over an example of the online indicator between Really Health and Allscripts. I'll begin by logging in as the provider into all the Allscripts application. And from here, we'll go to the patient's chart. And we've just been working with this one cardiology test patient. And right now, there are HL7 messages being sent from Really Health to all scripts. Um, and in the message, there's basically the patient's information and a flag. And you can see here, this orange box indicates that the patient is online now. Uh, and shortly, um, I'll show you what it looks like to have the patient go offline and the orange box go away. Once the orange box goes away, that's a confirmation that the second HL7 message has been processed. We'll give the application a second to process the message. And now, this is an indication that the patient is offline. And this is an example of online indicator.